What is up everybody, it's CJ Place here, and I'm back with another Sims 3 world overview. And y'all, this has got to be one of the coolest worlds I think I've ever seen in Sims 3. <laughs> so the name of this world is called Ships World. It is by Raphael Ninja. So Raphael has built a lot of different ships in the Sims 3, and basically they just put them all together in one world. So this world has like, I think eight different ships in total. You have yachts, pirate ships, aqua ships, cruise ships, and you even have a ship in a bottle, which is really cool. So I'm gonna look at all all of these today as you can see this world does have rabbit holes they're all over here in this little area i guess i can zoom down to kind of show y'all they're all over here in this little area so what you have to do is kind of like zoom all the way down so down here as you can see you have all your rabbit holes i think all of these are from the base game and at first i was a little bit confused because i was like how can elliot actually reach some of these because they're all kind of like jumbled up together but if you scroll down again there's actually like some more stairs and then your sims can actually access it so for example if i want elliot to say go to the stadium he would actually just go down here and just go to the stadium you know <laughs> there's also like a graveyard down here as well and then as you can see he can actually just go inside of it there's like different floors so rabbit holes are like on different levels basically so say for example i want him to go maybe to this town hall i just click on the town hall and i'll have him do it so i'll just fast forward a little bit and then he'll go inside his town hall so it may not seem like it at first though but every sim should be able to access all these rabbit holes but i'm mainly just here y'all for the ships themselves now i think maybe we could start off in the middle because this one i think is the ship in a bottle and i really want to see what this one looks like all right y'all so this is the ship in the bottle ship and i can see that there's like some doors down here so your sims should be able to at least go inside i don't know if they can actually reach the ship or not but i guess we'll find out let's just go ahead and open up the lot a little bit so if i scroll all the way down you have some bathrooms down here that your sims can actually use so once you scroll up ooh, okay so up here you seem to have like a little cabin or something like that so you can have your sims go to sleep this world is unpopulated but i do have some npcs walking around but you have like these little like rooms over here where your sims can sleep there's a little computer desk i guess this is maybe where like the captain would sleep or something like that you have some more computer desk over here as well this little area over here has some bookshelves there's also a bathroom over here as well and i'm just going to scroll up again so when you scroll up here again you have a treadmill there's also another bathroom over here there's another treadmill over here as well and then moving on over this way there's a bar and then you have like a little kitcheny type of area over here which is kind of interesting and then there's even like a tv in here too and then i'm gonna scroll upstairs again so when you scroll up again you have some lounge chairs there's some tables there's a stereo over here as well and then moving on over this way you have like a little living room area or like a little tv area with a game console and a little place to sit so that's got to be kind of cool y'all so i think that's pretty much all there is to see on this pirate ship i don't think i'm missing anything what's over here oh there's like a bear so you have like some bears over here there's like another bear over here as well and i think there's like another one so i guess that was the last thing to see on this lot though but it's kind of cool because you know it is like a ship in a bottle and you don't really see something like that every day now you have these other ships over here i think these are also pirate ships i want to say so i just want to see what these look like okay y'all so we're down here at the pirate ship so you have like these doors right here so i'm guessing your sims can actually go inside of these i just want to see what it looks like on the inside so when i scroll down oh, okay so this one looks like the one that we just saw earlier so it has like the same like you know cabins or rooms and stuff like that you also have like your bed there's a bathroom over here as well and then when you scroll upstairs kitchen area you have a bar and then you have like your bathrooms over here as well and then when you scroll up again you just have like a little place to sit so yeah i think this is the same as that i think these are like all pirate ships in the middle but really quick i just want to check out the one over here just to kind of see if anything was changed on the inside of it or not so this one is a little bit different because you have like this little bridge over here but i think it's mainly the same i'm just gonna scroll down just to see really quick so i think down here is just reversed so you have a bar and your kitchen on this side and then you have your bathroom over here on this side and then when you scroll down it's pretty much the same thing y'all so these pirate ships are pretty much the same as far as i can tell maybe we could try to check out maybe this ship over here next all right y'all so we're down here at this ship so i believe this one is called the air cruise ship so before we even get to the ship we have like a little like area over here i guess it's like the little loading area so your sims can like go up here or whatever now i don't know if a sim can actually reach this one you might have to teleport a sim here because i'm pretty sure they can't walk over here on this <laughs> i'm pretty sure i like i I want to know if I try to have Elliot go here. Can he actually reach it? Oh, he can. Yo, he can actually get up there. That's kind of cool. So like, I'll show you really quick one more time. He can actually walk on that. 
That is cool. I didn't know a sim could actually walk on this, y'all. Okay, well, let's check out the ship, though. So, I guess we can start at the top. So, over here at the top, though, you have a lot of places to lounge. There is a stereo. There's some treadmills over here as well. You have some bars. And there's a couple of chess tables. I'm going to go ahead and scroll down again. So when you scroll down here, you have like a little kitcheny type of area. So I'm guessing this is like a little cafeteria or like a little like food area. So you have your stoves, your fridge, there's a coffee machine and microwave. You have some tables over here where you can come and sit down. So over here though, you have your bathrooms and then you even have like a little pool area over here too. So that's kind of cool. And then when you scroll downstairs again, you have, oh, like a little movie theater, I guess, with a game console. And then over here, you have like a little library section, I guess, or like a little reading area. You can come and sit down and read if you want to. Over here, you have some desks. So I guess you could put like a laptop or a computer on these and have this be like a little computer area. So when you scroll down again at the bottom, you have like a lot of rooms down here. So you can have your sim sleep. There are some bathrooms in the middle. You have a couple nurseries down here. And then you have like a bigger better maybe this is like where the captain sleeps you know so this room has its own ensuite so you have like your toilet and you have your tub and stuff like that over here and then over here on this way is pretty much the same exact thing and then you have like another like bigger bedroom over here as well so this one was kind of cool though y'all i'm really surprised that elliot could walk across that i did not know he could do that okay so let's keep moving on so why don't we check out this ship over here so if you were wondering y'all this ship is actually kind of like flying or it's kind of like in the air now i don't know if elliot can actually get up here well i guess we'll try it out real quick just to see but i don't know if he can do it how would he get up here y'all oh i don't know how that's possible y'all but he got up here okay i don't know how that was possible <laughs> but he's up here though that is so cool though all right y'all so i don't really know what the name of this lot is but the one that we were just at is the air cruise ship fixed i guess it was a fixed version of it but i don't really know what the name of this one is though but we'll still look at it nonetheless so y'all this is so cool so i'm just gonna try to scroll down really quick though so down here at the bottom you just have some bathrooms and you have some showers and stuff like that down here let's go ahead and scroll up so when you go upstairs you have like some beds and there's like a little computer desk moving on over this way you have like a little place to sit there are some tables bookshelves there's a bar you have a chess table there's a stereo and a treadmill there's also a telescope over here as well and then let's scroll upstairs again so when you go upstairs again you have like a little kitcheny area so you have a fridge a stove you have a microwave over here as well and a grill and then when you go upstairs again you have a bed so i guess maybe this is where the captain would sleep and then you have like some more bets over here too and then when you scroll upstairs to the very top of the lot you have a couple art easels and a table but i think that's pretty much it for this one now down here i kind of just want to see what's down here though so down here i don't know y'all you're somehow some way the stairs are here i don't even know how this works maybe somebody in the comments can explain how this works i don't know but elliot went to this and then he went up there y'all i don't know but there's also like a grill down here, a picnic table. There's even like a ladder. So I don't know if there's anything down below. Oh, there is something down here. So down here, you have a couple beds and a fridge. And then you have like a sink. There's also like a counter over there as well. But let's go upstairs again. So there's also like this little building. So inside of here, you have more beds. And then there's even more beds up here too. So I don't really know y'all. Very interesting though. And then there's also a couple sailboats out here too. All right, y'all. So let's keep moving on. This is where I placed Elliot down at. Now he couldn't really afford to live on any of these lots so i had to use free real estate but let's check out this boat over here though this one i think looks kind of similar to the one that we were just at earlier but i just want to check it out just to see so over here you just have some lounge chairs and some treadmills there are some bars and chess tables and then when you scroll down you have some tables you have your little kitchen area you also have some bathrooms and there's like a pool area and then when you scroll down so this looks kind of similar to the one that we just saw earlier though you know you have like a little tv section bookshelves some desk and then down below it's kind of like the same thing rooms down here and some bathrooms so this one looks like the one that we were just at earlier so these over here are the last two let's maybe check out this one first because this one looks like it's kind of cool all right y'all so we're down here at this ship so this is the ss sim Raphael yacht so this is the yacht this looks really cool it looks like it has like a lighthouse outside of it though and it kind of looks like it's ported at like a place or something like that this is really nice so maybe we could just check out the yacht first so up here at the top you have a chess table there's some lounge chairs you have some tables and there's also a grill out here as well when you scroll down you have a like living room section you know so you can come and watch tv you can play video games if you want to there's a bar you have some places to sit and then you also have some bookshelves over there so when you scroll down again you have like a little kitcheny area there's also an art easel you have a little table over here i really want to know if elliot can come down here 
Let's just test it out real quick though. All right, y'all. So I brought Elliot to this lot for a second because I just want to see if you can actually go down below. Can he actually even like get up here at all? So he can actually get on the ship, but I want to know if he can actually go down below. What if I were to make him go here? Can he actually go down here? Okay, so he can go down here. Let's see, can you maybe go down here then? Okay, so he can go down here, go down these steps. So I think what you have to do is make him click on the steps themselves, and then he can actually go down here. Because otherwise, I don't think he can do it on his own. Down here, though, you have a little, like, kitchen-y area down here. You have a table. You have some art easels. And then going back over this way, you have some rooms. And then you also have your bathrooms. So as long as you click on these stairs, y'all, he should be able to come down here. Okay, that's cool. Now, I really just want to check out what this is behind him. So it looks like a row of houses or something. I don't really know. Or maybe they're like businesses. Let's just open them up to see. So down here, you have a kitchen and there's a bathroom and you have like these tables out here too maybe this is just supposed to be like a little backdrop or something i don't really know when you go over this way you just have some beds and there's also a shower when you scroll upstairs there's another bed and another shower there's a bathroom over here and you have like a little bedroom over here too there's also like a bed over there and then when you scroll up, it's kind of like the same thing. So I guess technically you could have a some sleep over here or stay here, I guess. But I think it's supposed to be like a backdrop, you know. Now, there's also like this lighthouse, I'm assuming. So over here, you have a telescope. And then there's also like a little place to sit. And then you have like this little light. And then when you scroll down, I don't really think there's anything inside of it. No, I don't think there's anything inside of it, though. But yeah, okay, that's kind of interesting though, y'all. Now, I don't know if Elliot can actually get up here or not. I guess we'll test it out really quick just to see. Can you actually get up here? How do you get up here? So he swims across. Yo, I don't know how this works, y'all, but it works. I don't know how that works. Maybe it's like an invisible stair or something. But as you can see, y'all, he can get up and he can get down. So that's kind of cool. All right, y'all. So last but not least, let's check out this other ship. All right, y'all. So we're down here at this ship. So this ship is the Aqua Expedition Isla Paradiso. Ooh, this looks really nice. So I know right off the bat, though, that you will need Island Paradise because, of course, we have, you know, the sailboats and stuff like that. But I really want to see what this looks like, y'all. So I'm just going to go ahead and open it up. So down here at the bottom, there's a bunch of beds where you can have your sims sleep they have their own ensuite bathrooms as well so as you can see like most of these rooms have double beds but you have a couple of these single beds over here and then inside of these rooms you have en suites that just have showers on the inside of them so that's kind of cool so i guess over here you have like a little area where you can eat so you have your fridges your stoves there's some tables and stuff there's already some food at some of these okay <laughs> but you have that down here and then when you scroll upstairs you have some treadmills some weight machines you have more rooms over here as well and then when you scroll upstairs again to the top you have like a i guess like a recreational type of area i guess so you have like some bookshelves and you have some places to sit you also have some tvs and some bars and then outside of the lot you have these art easels as well and then going over this way you have a foosball table there's a pool a chess table some lounge chairs out here as well and there's also another chess table over here too but anyway y'all that is all that i have for this video again this world is called ships world and i really like it y'all like this has got to be one of the most unique worlds i think i've ever seen in the sims 3 and i'm glad i got to look at it today because i just found it randomly so i really like it now as you could probably tell the world is a little bit laggy because there's a lot of detail on this world but i really like these and i'm pretty sure that you can download these lots separately so i'm gonna just leave this world link down below if you want to check it out i think that Raphael did a really good job with this world and i'm really happy i got to look at it today but i'm gonna leave this one link down below y'all but anyway y'all that is all that i have for this video if you did enjoy it please be sure to leave a like comment something down below follow me over on Twitch where I stream a lot more of The Sims and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Thanks for watching!